Why God Allows a Crisis Today, we gather to contemplate a question that has perplexed many throughout history. Why does it seem that sometimes life puts us through challenging crises? Now, I'm not going to delve into religious explanations. Instead, I'll explore this from a broader perspective that can resonate with people of diverse beliefs. In our journey through life, we often encounter crises, those moments when the ground beneath our feet seems to shake and everything we once knew is thrown into uncertainty. These crises can be personal, societal, or even global in nature. While they may bring pain, confusion, and disruption, they can also teach us valuable lessons and offer opportunities for growth. So, let's dive into why, in a world that sometimes feels harsh and unpredictable, these crises might have a purpose. Think of a crisis as a tough workout for your character and resilience. Just as our muscles grow stronger with resistance training, we grow mentally and emotionally robust when we face and overcome challenges. Crisis can be the catalyst that pushes us to adapt, innovate, and become more resilient individuals. When everything is running smoothly, it's easy to coast through life without deeply questioning our choices and priorities. Crises force us to pause and reevaluate what truly matters to us. They help us discern between the essential and the superficial, encouraging us to focus our energy on what brings us genuine fulfillment. Crises often reveal the strength of our collective humanity. They ignite compassion as we come together to support one another in times of need. These moments can lead to a deeper sense of connection and remind us of the value of empathy and kindness. History has shown that some of the most significant breakthroughs and innovations emerge from crises. Necessity sparks creativity, and challenges drive us to find new solutions to old problems. Crises can be the breeding ground for progress and positive change. Difficult times are profound teachers. They force us to confront our limitations, face our fears, and learn valuable life lessons. Crisis can be the catalyst for personal growth, helping us become wiser, more resilient, and better equipped to navigate the future. Adversity can reveal the depth of our character and inner strength. It is during these challenging times that we discover what we are truly made of, finding courage we didn't know we possessed and developing a sense of inner fortitude. In the midst of a crisis, we often gain a newfound appreciation for the simple joys of life, health, love, friendship, and freedom. These moments of hardship can lead to a deeper sense of gratitude for the blessings we may have taken for granted. In conclusion, while crises may initially appear as unwelcome guests in our lives, they can also be powerful catalysts for growth, resilience, and positive change. They challenge us to become better versions of ourselves, to connect with one another on a deeper level, and to re-evaluate our priorities. In a world that is sometimes unpredictable and challenging, it is through these crises that we discover our true strength and potential. So let us embrace the idea that why God allows a crisis is not merely a question of faith, but a reflection of our shared human experience. It is an opportunity for us to rise above adversity, learn, grow, and become stronger, both individually and as a society. Thank you, and may you find inspiration in the face of life's challenges, knowing that within every crisis lies the potential for positive transformation.